and welcome back to another Dish of Carrie's Gardening Channel. So today is August the 17th, 2023, and we're going to be doing ladybug release in the greenhouses here. So um, it's getting closer to nightfall, and we're going to be releasing them here. You can also release them in the morning. I just got my shipment today. We're also going to be doing uh, lacy at wing eggs, which I'll be doing that in another video. But the first thing that you want to do is if you've sprayed anything on your plants before you get your ladybugs, you want to wash all that down and wash it off of them. So um, nothing's been sprayed in here for a while. Uh, you can see we have all kinds of plants in here. We're dealing with spider mites in here, um, a few white flies, and we just started seeing some aphids. So uh, we have released ladybugs earlier this year and they had everything cleaned out. So we're going to be releasing some more here. So I have my watering wand set to mist and we're just going to gently mist over these plants here so that the ladybugs have something to drink. And just a real fine mist, you don't want too much on. And I've already went back through the whole rest of the way and did that through this one here. So we're going to get our ladybugs released here. So these are how the ladybugs come here, and they are alive, they're moving around in here. Uh, I got 1,500 of these, and we're going to start releasing them here. I'm going to cut this bag open. So I got this open here, and the ladybugs are crawling out. And we're just going to start releasing them here. They say about putting them down at the ground. Uh, as you can see here, we really can't see the ground from these plants here. Should I get on the stem? Because of how many there are. So I'm just going to kind of lay this right here for now. And I'm going to let some crawl out because we had spider mites on these, on these over here. So I want to focus on this. We had a lot of spider mites on the marigolds. Um, it was a mistake to put the marigolds in the greenhouse. Right, we're going to be dividing these up between all four greenhouses. If you have any sticky traps up, you want to make sure that you get rid of your sticky traps so that your ladybugs don't get stuck on them. Because we don't want our ladybugs stuck on the sticky traps. We want them out and we want them crawling around. Got it on my hand there. We're just sort of letting some of these release here. And they're just sort of kind of going to town there. over here. This side over here. We're going to put some over here on the Dusty Miller. I might have to cut your bag open more. Well, I don't want too many out at one time because we got to separate these between three other greenhouses. Okay, we're going to move on here. Oops, I had one on my leg. I don't know where that one went. We're going to move down here. So these here had the spider mites the worst. And we were spraying earlier. Down here to ground, it's a little closer. So we're just kind of releasing some of these out here. And now we're going to let them just have their feast and meal here. There, there's some food on there for you. Yeah, they're already eating. Here, you can see here, they're already after the spider mites here. This leaf here has spider mites on it, and they're already eating it. They're going to clean Ooh. that up real nice for me there.
So we're putting some out here on the snapdragons in another greenhouse. So this one here, you can see, is covered in white flies here, this greenhouse here. And we're releasing the ladybugs in here. We do have some laceate wings that are in here already on their own. They just kind of found the greenhouse and uh, they've just been in here. So I'm going to get this. Okay, so um, I did find some spider mites on some of my eucalyptus trees. So we're releasing some ladybugs in around here. And uh, this is another greenhouse. We're also dealing with some white flies in here and a few aphids. So we're just getting these out here and we're letting them go. Some on our eggplants here. I'm just kind of letting it go at the base down here. So it's the next day here from our ladybug release. I'm in the old greenhouse here and you can see there's a ladybug here on uh, the eggplant. And there's one over here on one of the carnations. And you can see there's one here on one of the bunny tails. So uh, they are in the greenhouses here. And then uh, the rest of them I had left them released in here. Um, I can't get through because uh, there's so many white flies in here. We were actually, we had to get another shot back. We were, before we released the ladybugs, we were shaping, shaking the plants and uh, sucking the white flies up in the vacuum cleaner because of how many white flies were in here. So this here got the rest of them in here. And then, uh, like I said, we're going to be, um, we're doing the lace wings too. So, um, you do want to keep it moister in uh, your greenhouses if you do your ladybug releases in your greenhouses. And uh, you want to provide them with uh, some just a gentle fine mist over your plants to uh, give them that little bit of a drink there and keep the humidity up some for them. But like I said, we've done different ladybug releases before and uh, wanted to do one here. So if you like my video, please like, comment, subscribe. Please don't forget to hit the little notification button. That's why I put a new video on. Also follow me on Twitter. I'll have a link down in the description for my Twitter account. Thank yous for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.